WHDD presents Susan Says. The textbook definition of a hero. A hero is someone who can be looked up to for their actions. Bravery is usually the biggest trait of a hero. This person has usually overcome huge obstacles to survive or to rescue others. Sound like anyone you know or know of? Maybe a soldier? Maybe someone who was shot down and survived five years of torture and severe beatings and wouldn't leave his comrades, though he could have gotten out early? Sound familiar? Someone who retained a sense of humor after five years of being this prisoner? Someone with character and warmth? Someone named John McCain. I'm a Democrat, but I know a hero, and he can be a Republican because that's what he was and a senator who was outspoken and caring and voted the right way sometimes, sometimes not, but always a hero. And this despicable, deranged Donnie who pretends to be president has the gall, the unmitigated chutzpah to trash him, a dead hero, are you kidding me? I can't take it, I just can't take it anymore. I don't like Megan McCain's views, but I support her, her marvelous, wonderful homage to her father at his funeral, her brave response to this sicko now, she is right. No one will ever love hashtag 45-ish the way her father was loved in this country. What is wrong with the rest of the Republicans? Johnny Isaac, the only one who defended his cohort. Mitt Romney, kind of, mushy, but okay, he tried. Lindsey Graham, how dare you? You cried. He was your best friend and brother, and you support this piece of orange garbage. My opinion of you is forever damaged. No way back now. The end. Goodbye. Shepard Smith told it. He told it like it is. Crazy. Thank God for someone on Fox who tells the truth. I am fortunate enough to know someone who was friends with the late John McCain and tells me he was everything wonderful we hoped and thought he was. Oh, an idiot in the White House. The man is dead, so he couldn't thank you for allowing or facilitating or whatever the hell you think you did about his funeral. You were forced to put up the flag the way it should of honoring him. I just can't. It never gets any better. It just keeps getting worse. Someone make it end, please. Rest in peace, Senator McCain, true hero. At least you won't have to ever see deranged Donnie again in the afterlife because he's going to hell. We know that. Susan Silver was one of the original writers of such TV classics as The Mary Tyler Moore Show, Maud and Bob Newhart. She lectures and teaches sitcom writing and had a column on the New York Social Diary called The Search for Mr. Adequate. She hasn't found him yet. Appearing on TV and radio often, she expresses her views on life and opinions on everything.